Barakatha Yahoa, Barakatha Yahoa Shai, Kol Halayim La Yahoa, Bahasham Yahoa Shai, Barakaha Kodash, which means all uh, all praises to Yahoa is the name of the Heavenly Father. Bahasham means in the name. Yahweh Shai is the name of his only begotten Son, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. Barakaha Kodash means in the Holy Spirit, the Spirit of Truth, the only way you can worship the Father and the Son. Double honors to the apostles and the elders, a great millstone, peace, blessings, salutations to all you brothers who are preaching the gospel in truth and in sincerity, always in charity. And um, it's going to be a quick, uh, Lord willing, a quick response lesson to the elder Yashawamba down in uh, 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 Dallas. You know, um, the title of the video is What God Are They Speaking Of? You know, and um, according to, uh, matter of fact, we'll just get straight into the scriptures. This is a... Uh, the book of 1 John 4 and 1 And it reads Beloved, believe not every spirit But try the spirits Whether they are of the Most High Because many false prophets are going out into the world man. Which was a, a, a prophesied What happened man In the book of Peter it says False teachers and uh, false prophets shall arise Bringing in damnable heresies You know in Acts the 20th chapter It speaks about uh, 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 wolves coming in Not sparing the flock You know Jeremiah the 23rd chapter, Ezekiel the 34th chapter. So all throughout the scriptures, the uh, 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 it prophesied of false prophets coming, you know, speaking of uh, of falsehoods, man, who's using the Bible as a cover. You see. So even uh, outwardly they appear righteous, outwardly they appear uh, uh, godly, outwardly they uh, seem to be serving Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai, but inwardly, what man? Hey, hey, they uh, 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 they full of wickedness, man. They go after their own belly, after their own mind. You know, after their own thoughts. You see? So it says, try the spirit by the spirit. And, and, and how would you do that? This is the book of John, chapter 6, and verse 63. It reads, It is the spirit that quickeneth, the flesh profiteth nothing. The words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life, man. You see? So you try the spirit according to the spirit of uh, 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 the words that's written within these pages. You see? So you try the spirit according to the word. You know, if what they say in line up according to what the Bible says, then hey, according to uh, this is the book of Isaiah, chapter 8, and verse 20. It says, To the law and to the testimony, if they speak not according to this word, it is because there is no light in them, man. So you got guys that are, uh, 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 bring out a scripture, like for an example, you know, Lord willing, I got a, a, a lesson coming, but um, quick example. This guy right here, man. You know? Uh, Salaki. But this guy right here, man. You see? So he brought out a, a, a couple scriptures where, um, matter of fact, I just bring out one scripture that he brought out real fast. You know? Because I got a, a, um, a lesson coming. Based off what that guy said, you know, Lord willing is edifying through the spirit, Lord willing this is edifying. But he brought out this scripture. This is Isaiah 11 and 12. And he shall set up an ensign for the nations and shall assemble the outcasts of Israel and gather together the dispersed of Judah from the four corners of the earth. So my man's read this scripture and said only Judah is, is scattered to the four corners. How? It says the outcasts of Israel and gathered together the dispersed of Judah. You see? So even in even in this scripture alone, that dude just uh, 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 it wasn't according to the word, you know, even in this one scripture alone, you know. So you try the spirit by the spirits, man, and uh, according to uh, this is um, Isaiah 28 and nine, it says, whom shall he teach knowledge and whom shall he make to understand doctrine? Them that are weaned from the milk and drawn from the breast, man. So when we come into this faith, uh, the Yahweh Shai said what? Our Lord and Savior said what, man? That you must uh, be reborn. That you must be as this little child again. You understand? So when we come into this faith, uh, uh, this faith, Salaki. When we come into this faith, hey, hey, when we come into the uh, 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 the face of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, which is this knowledge. You know, the Lord uh, 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 shining that light upon us again. So when we come back into this, man, hey, we're little children again. What little child don't need to be led? What child come out the womb speaking, walking, and, and, and doing uh, 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 what grown-ups do, man? No, a child learns. You see? That's why the Lord said uh, you must humble yourself as this little child in order to enter into the kingdom of heaven. So we have men, we have elders, 
that's before us, man, a, a, who are showing us the way, who are leading us, being that example. You see? So we ought to follow that example, man. Because if you're not following that example, then you're leaning to your own understanding. You see? Verse 10, it says, For precept must be upon precept, precept upon precept, line upon line, line upon line, here a little and there a little, man. That's how you teach the word, you know? And like Peter wrote, this is uh, 1 Peter 2 and 2. I started one. It says, Wherefore, laying aside all malice and all guile and hypocrisies and envies and all evil speakings. You see? Evil speakings goes into what? Speaking lies, man. Speaking out of your own mind. You see? We got to be renewed in the spirit, man. We got to speak the words uh, according to, uh, 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 to uh, what the Yahweh about Shem Yahweh Shah laid it out. And how did he do that? He did it through the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, man. You see? Verse 2, as newborn babes desire the sincere milk of the word that ye may grow thereby, man. So just like a, 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 a newborn baby, man, it, it says wean from the milk and drawn from the breast. So just like a newborn baby needs to be on his mother's uh, a, a, a breast in order it to grow. You see? Same thing as us, man. We're on the breast. We're on the milk. Just like a child. And then it says them that are weaned from the milk and drawn from the breast. Meaning what, man? That now, a, 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 now uh, you, you've become off the titty, you know? So now you can start eat uh, 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 solid foods now, you know? That still need to be mashed up and chopped up, <laughs> you know? Because there's levels to it. It's verse 3. If so be, ye have tasted that the Lord is gracious, man. Hey, so when we come into this faith, what should be our mindset? What, what, what's the thing that's being uh, 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 taught? This is a uh, revelation... 19 and 10 and I fell at his feet to worship him and he said unto me see thou do it not I am thy fellow servant and of thy brethren that have the testimony of Yahweh Shai worship the most high for the testimony of Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy man so when you come into this faith man you're called you're called to do what to prophesy you understand to say uh, 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 to say things uh, 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 that's going to happen before it happens man that's our job you understand? So that's how you know if, if a man is sent by Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. That's how you know if that man really teaching uh, 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 the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. You know? Because like El Elder Yahshua video, he went in and explained that there is many gods, man. You see? What God are you talking about? You understand? So if you really sincerely trying to serve the true God, the only, the one power, Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, then you ought to uh, uh, take heed to the uh, apostles and elders of Great Millstone, man. You see? Because this is the true doctrine. This is the only doctrine. This is the only way, according to John uh, uh, 14, verse 6. So uh, from there, we have just jump to, uh, to um, what, Slaki, what scripture was that? Yep. This is um, Acts chapter 26. And uh, I'm going to get straight to the point. Verse 22, this is Paul speaking, man. Let's see what uh, the things that Paul taught. This is Acts 20, 26 and 22. Having therefore obtained help of the Most High, I continue unto this day, witnessing both to small and great, saying none other things than those which the prophets and Moses did say should come. That Yahweh Shai should suffer and that he should be the first that should, be, that should rise from the dead and should show light unto the people and to the Gentiles, man. You see? So that's so that's the message that uh, 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 we're going to come in, man, because this is um, first Corinthians. Two and 16, it says, for who have known the mind of the Lord that he may instruct him. But we have the mind of Yahweh Shai. And what was the mind of Yahweh Shai? His mind was to come and gather uh, 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 the elect of Israel, man, as it is written. He, he said, uh, uh, my meat is to do the will of him that sent me. If I'm not mistaken, that's John, the eighth chapter. Uh, Salaki, bear with me. It might be the fourth chapter. It might be the fourth chapter. Salaki, brothers. Yep, this is John 4 and 34. It says, Yahweh Shah saith unto them, My meat is to do the will of him that sent me and to finish his work, man. You see? 
So what are we called to do? We're called to uh, 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 to bid them to the marriage, man. To go out into the highways and hedges and do what? Tell the people to repent because the kingdom of heaven is at hand, man. Isaiah 58 and 1, cry aloud, spare not, lift up thy voice like a trumpet, show my people their transgressions and the house of Jacob their sins, man. So who are the ones that's out there sparing not? You see? We don't care about your feelings, your emotions, what you think. No, it's all about what the scriptures say. You understand? Who are the ones out there doing that, man? Hey, because the ones that's going to be standing in Yahweh Shai stead, the ones that's going to be doing his will and doing the things that he did are going to, uh, uh, are, are going to, um, this is uh, Amos 5 and 10, they're going to be hated. Because Yahweh Shai said what? You they can't hate, it's me they hate, man. That's how you know you worshiping the, uh, uh, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. This is Amos 5 and 10. They hate him that rebuketh in the gate, and they abhor him that speaketh uprightly, man. You see? So when people start to separate you uh, 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 from their company, man, when pe people start to speak ill of you, you see? That's when you know you're serving the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob in truth and in sincerity, man. Because there's no way uh, there's no way around these scriptures. There's no way around this word. In the book of Isaiah, this is Isaiah 55 and uh, verse 11. It says, so shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void, but it shall accomplish that which I please, and it shall prosper in the thing whereto I sent it, man. You see? So a real man of the Lord, a real man of Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shai, you understand? What is, what is he going to be speaking of? This is Jeremiah 28 and 8. The prophets that have been before me and before thee of old prophesied both against many countries and against great kingdoms of war and of evil and of pestilence, man. So that's what a man of Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai is going to come teaching, man. You understand? They're going to come teaching about the destruction that's about to take a, 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 a place. You know, the destruction that's about to come upon this place, man. The judgments that's about to come upon these heathens, you understand? Starting with Esau, Edom. For the things, the atrocities that they done unto the children of Israel. You see? We're preaching about uh, 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 the elect of Israel being gathered. Not all Israel, not all Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, so-called. No. The elect of those people, man. You see? These is the things that the scriptures speak. These is the, the these is the things that a real man of Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shai is going to be speaking, man. You see, and he's not going to be ashamed to speak these things as it is written. Matter of fact, this is Mark eight and thirty eight. Whosoever therefore shall be ashamed of me and of my words in this adulterous and sinful generation of him also shall the son of man be ashamed when he cometh in the glory of his father and with the holy angels, man. You see? So the totality uh, 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 of this word is what, man? You you going out in the high wages and hedges, man. You prophesying the downfall of this wicked ass society. The punishment that's going to come upon these heathens, that thousand year of, of, of long, hard uh, 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 slavery, man. Long, hardcore slavery. You understand? Thousand years, man. And after the thousand years, Esau Edom is going to be exterminated from off this planet. You see? That's sound doctrine according to the word. The book of Jeremiah, uh, uh, chapter 12, if I'm not mistaken, it says that my heritage is like a speckled bird. So all these people who think uh, uh, on, only black people are Israelites, man, hey, they ain't sent by Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. You see? Because there are people who, who, who look like uh, 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 other nations who are actually Israelites. And there are people who look like Israelites and they're actually other nations, man. This simple and plain. So to all you, so to all you guys straddling the fence, all you guys in these other camps, man, you know, or the question is, what God are you serving? What God are you speaking of? You see, everybody outside of Great Millstone, what God are you speaking of, man? Hey, even brothers in Great Millstone, you understand? Because in the Book of First John it says, what, man? Let us not. Matter of fact, let me get that.
This is 1 John 3 and 18. It says, my little children, let us not love in word, neither in tongue, but in deed and in truth, man. You see? So even brothers in Great Millstone, man, if you ain't if, if you ain't following a protocol that's been laid out through the spirit in that camp, man, if you ain't following a protocol that came down from the spirit of Yahweh Basham Yahushai, you see, if you ain't following uh, uh, the orders within your camp, if you ain't doing the things necessary according to the spirit, hey, 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 then you don't love the Lord, man, and you're worshiping another God. You see, this is the book of John four. In 22, it says, ye worship, ye know not what. We know what we worship. Salaki, Salaki. Um, 24, Salaki. 24 is the point. Hey, but no, matter of fact, I'm going to start at 22. It says, ye worship, ye know not what. We know what we worship for salvation is of the Jews. Salvation is of the elect of Israel, man. You see? A lot of these people, man, they, they go around, they say Yahweh or, or they call him Yah or, or whatever, or whatever, man. The true name is Yahweh. His true uh, son's name is Yahweh Shai. You see? But if you're not following uh, Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai in word and in deed, in truth and in sincerity, then, then you're worshiping another God, man. This is verse 23. But the hour cometh and now is when the true worshiper shall worship the Father in spirit and in truth. For the Father seeketh such to worship him, man. So the, the, the Father is seeking for those, those ones to worship him in spirit and in truth. You see? John 17 and 17, it says, thy word is truth. Sanctify them through thy word. You understand? We already broke down what the spirit is. John 6 and 63, man. The words that's written within these pages, that's the spirit. So our spirit beareth witness with this spirit that we are the children of the living power, man. Because of the words, precept upon precept, line upon line, man, that no man can gainsay or resist, man. You see? Verse 24, the Most High is a spirit, and they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth, man. So you got to worship him according to as the scripture says, not according to your own uh, uh, interpretation or your own understanding. No, nah, man, this is uh, the book of 2 Peter 1 and 20. It says, knowing this first, that no prophecy of the scripture is of any private interpretation, man. You see? So all these guys that got their own breakdowns according to these scriptures is because it's pride on them, man, and the Lord ain't dealing with them. This is the true doctrine, and, it, and, and it's going to be found out soon, man. So all you guys that don't believe, I'm going to end it on this scripture right here if the Spirit don't give me anything else. This is Ezekiel 2 and 5. This is our job, man. Uh, matter of fact, I'm going to start at, uh, at three this is ezekiel two and three and he said unto me son of man i send thee to the children of israel to a rebellious nation that hath rebelled against me they and their fathers have transgressed against me even unto this very day hey, 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 and the brothers that's within that's within israel that's within this truth you know the true doctrine you know we got to realize and understand that the most wickedest people upon this planet is the people that know that they israelites man they more wicked than a uh, than a Jake that don't know. Hey, a nigga walk up on the line smoking weed. Hey, what's this about? Hey, you know you're Israelite. Oh, yeah, I know. And then he walk down the street and continue his madness, man. You know? He gonna be beaten with, with few stripes. But the ones that's walking up and down the street with the fringes. Shalom, Aki. <laughs> it ain't even no E sound in the Hebrew, man. You know? But to, the, uh, uh, to these niggas, all you nigga women on the comment board. Oh, no, the Judas did. And that, and that, hey, hey, all that madness is going to be put, put down, man. You see? Verse 4. For they are impudent children and stiff-hearted. I do send thee unto them, and thou shalt say unto them, Thus saith the Lord power. And they, whether they will hear or whether they will forbear, for they are a rebellious house, yet shall know that there has been a prophet among them, man. You see? So the men here at Great Millstone, man, hey, you're going to know uh, 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 that uh, 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 those men, these men, us men, Yahweh Basham, Yahweh Sharatazah, were the true prophets that were sent, man. You see? Are the true prophets that were sent. Because any, uh, uh, whenever Great Millstone name get brought up around these Israelite camps, man, 
uh, it's always a, um, a, a, a stigma that comes with it, man. A negative stigma at that. All oh, they're child rapists, which is false. All oh, they're bums. All oh, they're homeless. They ain't got jobs, which is false. Here it is, brothers got uh, smartphones, internet. Here it is, the, uh, the, the men of Great Millstone. Hey, 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 the order was three videos a week. And this brother's meeting three videos a day. How's these videos getting uploaded? How's these brothers doing these videos? Computers, cameras. <laughs> Come on, man. Brothers getting back and forth uh, 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 to, the, uh, uh, to their uh, prospective campsites, wherever it may be. Majority of the time is downtown uh, uh, in, the, uh, uh, in the city that they're in. You know, how is these brothers getting back and forth, man? If they ain't got a, 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 a car to get back and forth, then guess what? They got the money to get on the bus or a train, man. Oh, but all oh, these men broke. You see? Hey, but it's all according to the scripture because that was prophesied as well. This is 1 Corinthians 4 and 13. It says, being defamed, we entreat. You see? Being defamed, we entreat, man. Hey, Yahweh Shah was reviled. He didn't revile back, man. He took it. Same thing as us, man. It's written within these pages that they was going to bear false witness against us. That they was going to uh, uh, bring up all kind of uh, uh, false accusations against us, man. It's already written. So according to, uh, 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 I believe it's 1 Peter, the fourth chapter, man. Hey, 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 marvel not concerning the fiery trial, which is to try you, man. That's all a part of, that's all a part of the, uh, uh, the trial of our faith. You see? It says, being defamed, we entreat. We are made as the filth of the world. Look at that word world. It's cosmos, man. So we are made of the filth of Israel and are the offscoring of all things unto this day. So the apostles and elders uh, 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 during the time of Yahweh Shah, they was considered the offscoring. They was considered the filth of Israel, man. So when you look at today's uh, 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 groups of Israelites, man, who are considered the filth? Who considered the offscoring? Who considered the worst in Israel? And we are gladly accept that, man, because that means we're in good company and that means we're doing what's right in the eyes of Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. So what God are you serving, man? Is it the God of Yahweh? Uh, is, is it the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, whose name is Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai, man, in the name of his only son? You see? His only begotten son? Or is you serving your own goddamn belly, man? Or is your God your belly, meaning your own mind? All praises, honor, and glory be to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Baruch HaKwadash. Double honors to uh, uh, our apostles and elders at Great Millstone who taught us this word. Peace, blessings, salutations to all you brothers who preaching the gospel in truth and sincerity, always in charity. Shalom.